An action potential, represented by a red strip, spreads along an unmyelinated axon and depolarizes the axon membrane ahead. This depolarization leads to the opening of sodium channels. Since there are sodium channels along the entire length of the axon membrane, the action potential is actively regenerated at every point along the axon, and thus advances toward the terminal boutons at a constant rate. An action potential spreads along a myelinated axon. When it reaches a node of Ranvier, the action potential is regenerated. It then continues along the myelin-covered segments via passive conduction, in a fast but decaying fashion. Thus, action potentials in a myelinated axon advance via saltatory conduction, actively regenerated at each node of Ranvier, while passively conducted between the nodes. In this segment, the conduction in the two types of axons is compared. Due to the passive conduction along the myelinated segments, saltatory conduction in myelinated axons is up to 15 times faster than the conduction in unmyelinated axons. Saltatory conduction is also more efficient. Less sodium enters the axon in its myelinated segments. Thus, less energy is required to maintain the sodium balance by the sodium-potassium pumps.